is Kelebi the Bomb. Your stepchild will also go to Airport International, will also go to British International, and they are equal. So all the young girls who are you know, walking up and down, and you are just wasting your ass and menstruating every month, block your menstruation with the month, take me out. Mungi be few. Mama will list up the names. A poor black and crab. Or no woman in two shall be gone. Or no one can say, Here's the name. You have a chance. Look at it. Don't, don't, don't tell me, Patrice. No. No. You don't have a chance. Yeah, but they, so what, what, what was Gabby saying? She asked me. So, or today I don't even have a chance. No, so you don't have a chance. Where is it? You're looking for it. Gabby, man, Patrice, don't try Patrice. Because Patrice himself, he only goes to the gym. That's all. If you are lying to impregnate you, the child will become a gym baby. So what I'm saying is that step children have a way they come. And when they are coming, you need to plan them. But there are some that they are unplanned. And you know about the pregnancy. Unwanted, unplanned, planned, and unwanted. Unwanted are those ones here, GNE, not having any sense. So we are saying that how do I manage step children as a wife and a woman? Your definition as a sitting down is two shapes. Remember the last time I said that we don't deal with stepchildren, we manage them. Somebody tied the stepchild of Bunasam or not that's a breast of a book. And of what I don't have plenty. You know, there are some stepchildren who are more demons who want you to go to jail. Of what I'm planning to. Of Bunasam, planning to. Of bread or your sin. Like you. Okay. Maya, I want bread. Then the woman says, I see something just entered into her. And she came back to herself. They see her neck. She smiled. She's Madina. Wow. If you don't learn how to manage that children and you want to deal with them, you will die. Because if you are beating a child, the rationale behind the beating is that run away. Thanks be to my mother. My mother knows I run away. So every time they want to beat me, they wait till I go to the bathroom and come and I'm dressing up and sing hallelujah, hallelujah. Then you hear the rock. Cry, I love you. Kara. Where? In God's house, I'm all there. You know, I'm going to see them, boy. Pack it up. Body! It's just not the dog. I can't beat my mother. I've told her that her. When I push her one, she will fall. But when I push her, she will die. When she dies, I'll see her baby. So she blocks the door. So one day, I told my auntie that when my mother wants to beat me, she blocks the door. So me too, now when I go to the bathroom, I know that I'm going to the park to play ball. When I go to the bathroom, I go with a sponge, okay. and I add powder and pomade and my dress. So when she was expecting me in the room to come and beat me, this is a long time. Yeah. And as I'm lying down in the evening, when I put my head down, I watch and see my father. When my father is coming, I'm not supposed to go and beat her. I'm forced to go and beat him because they reported me. If you don't go by you, me too, nothing can win. Why? I can't win it while she was sleeping in your sleep. Quiet, is she? <laughs> But I'm talking about these things I went through whilst I was still with my mother and father. Somebody will get to a point that you think that the way they are treating me, I see I am not their children. But I'm saying that you don't have to deal with it. So there are times that your right to, to spank a stepchild is yours. My mother was spanking me, they were beating me, they were stabbing me. There are times that they'll say, You eat. I, I suffered me today if I'm a pastor. I sat there though. There are times they said don't go to church. And because I was not working, my mother would give me money and I would use part for transportation. My church was then in Aladdin. I walked from Aladdin to see for more than three months walking. And I'm just sinking as I walk. You know, Aladdin Connors, you drop, 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 cap price, then you enter into new tank called Beshin and Kebbe. Then all of a sudden, you're going to go to the hmm. Then you knock a bus stop. Then continue the journey. And I'm singing, blowing tongues. Gay tongues. It's not Holy Spirit, it's walking spirit. <laughs> All those times, what, what was going through my mind is that is, is, are you sure this woman is my mother? Mm. Is my father truly my father? Mm. Why am I? Because my father wanted me to go to church with him. He was going to Methodist. Wow. And then I said no, because my gift is Methodist. <laughs> and I'm into. <laughs> so if you go, 
social media. Software, Castro share. Yeah, my two hours. Bob Ronnie did The Holy Ghost. Was the Holy Ghost. No, I saw a video of a pastor saying. Is he a junior pastor, senior pastor, up and coming pastor, or a gifted pastor? Why a prophet? So, a whole thing to me. The only pastor that can say Castro is alive that I believe is Prophet Emmanuel Gibbs. Yeah. No, only Castro is alive. That Castro is alive. That Castro is alive. But is this, is this anything important? Is Castro my phone? Ah, this is how you did your dinner, baby, and you broke your own car, baby. Who's home? Who's home? My best man, Kai, and Mama, but Minamo. Oh, Mammy, oh, Grand Cassia, no, I would not name it. Shall we have a coin, Jimmy, Jimmy, Sala Bema, if you walk with Fukra, Nanny, Nanya Bassa, or no one Cassa one week, why? Because you forgot my birthday. Minamo. Now, for why again? No, come on, be any more. Oh, come here, we come here. Oh, come here. Oh, come here. Oh, come here. I let Ghana celebrate my wife's birthday, no me. Who can say? Maybe I say. 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 So you see, you see, you are giving them the right information about me. No, the issue is that my wife delivery days, I will never forget. They say the sound is low. I can't hear what sound is. Can't hear you. 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 Last week we did our best, and I think that Honorable Kennedy Dupont is saying that ladies should emulate one lady, and I know and stop fighting over men. That statement, I don't agree. Women, fight over men. Fight over men. If you are a woman and you have what it takes for a man to, to, to come for it, fight over men. If you don't have what it takes, take this advice. I mean, be a man. Oh, my baby, be a dear. Yes, here. Who's me? The other she should say. The dear romance, the same dear suit. The other son, the romance, the dear. And I mean, so. Oh, we, 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 oh, no, I begin to my head. O come paint ko catch am say won say ye she ni twaso o kunu. Na o nim na o kunu bi ho na nti ho na ko she. Go se na o kan no you are experiencing the thing on the minute. Me ni se video na me defend me. Nti won ko she ni wo ho na. Honorable, hear the girl. Hear the girl. And you are accusing me. Me am say anything. Honorable ma ko fake one. O say. Honorable ma ko fake one. This is quiet. Creative act. Me na mengo ka. Na yefa mengo parliamentary select committee. Mengo ka. You are a black master. Say, okay, come and test it. Bako shibu order. Me, 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 me. Is that what? Me to me ka o. Ona bo, I'm calling you after this show. Eh, this show ha me refi. Ona bo, I'm calling you after this show. Mate, mago kreko. But eh, ona bo mago kreko man. Ona bo si as man kopa. I think people are not getting the sound because of the network. I was no use internet. I said, go first one, move my network. It's clear now. It's clear. I'm the first time. I'm going to find the body of the block. I'm going to find the block. Okay, that we get to go for that. Okay, 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 we get to go for that.
You're going to for your talk with you. So the next 10 minutes, you should get the ticket of going away. I am not sure not going at night. I have any idea. Gana for the talk with you. I'm selling it. I'm just selling it. I'm not coming. See, I was addicted to it. Like, maybe this way, you're going to be with Marisa. It's good for your throat. Let's see, copy that. That's a paper. I'm going to do it. Why are you doing it? You you package in India, a top pass over. When her bushy hair blocking our network, but by the grace of God, we penetrated in the middle. Oh, Joyce, that's it. Love you, guys. Joyce, we love you. Thank you. So the sound is back. Okay. If our counselor is approaching. So please share it on your page so that others can join as well. Thank you. So so just just go in there that if 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 you have a a, a producer whose skin is fair. So let's talk about our topic for today. So we've been discussing this and last week with Miss Rosie. And uh, let me continue from here. Sorry for the bad network. I don't know what is happening, but I think the network is the reason why. Yeah. Uh, okay, Rosie's sound is down. That's true. Okay, it's still down. I don't know if because of hello, the hello, hello, hello. something. Is it because it's facing down? Okay, so put on me and let's turn his microphone upside. And let's see. So thank you very much for your support. I want to have a clarity before I continue the topic. Hello, so we've been is discussing. It is it better? Let's check. Is it better? We'll take it off from let's, let's do it. Okay. So Ghana, uh, my happy land, land of rich resources. We've been discussing how to manage stepchildren in, in marriage as a wife, and not just as a wife, but also as uh, as uh, a, 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 a woman. And uh, there are two categories of human beings. You know, uh, and it's very important for us to understand that if we get to a point in our life and the life we are living is a life that you can't do anything than to manage uh, the children. We said in the previous thing that we're doing that we don't manage, but what we do is that we don't deal, but we manage them. And today I was telling you that even our own children, our own parents, our mother and our own fathers, Unfortunately for us, the way they treat some of us, we tend to think that we are not their biological children. I tell you, you are giving us examples. And, and me, I've gone through it. If I tell you the regimental order that me, I've gone through seriously under the tutelage of my dad and my mom, and not just them. My <clears> own <throat> was that the community was interested in who council was supposed to be. So everywhere you go, everybody can spank you. Everybody can shout on you. So the life I was living was the community-based raise, raising up. Right. Do you understand what I'm saying? So it comes to a time that one drink and you don't think deep. You would think that your parents, they are not your original parents. They hate you or something. And I'm saying that the same way at times, the stepchildren we have, we want to raise them in a certain category. And they think the same way that we are thinking. I came to promise you and tell you something. That if you have a stepchild at home, don't throw in the towel. Get ready to learn how to manage them. Don't deal with them. When you deal with them, it will suffer. And when you ask me whether somebody is a witch, I only know witches when I'm able to diagnose them spiritually. It is easy for a stepchild to be a witch. And it is also easy for your biological child to be a witch. Okay. Right. Because witchcraft sees a spirit. And acquiring it could be a gift. I mean, the spirit needs a place to operate. Once you create a platform for them, they will come in. So a stepchild can be a witch. But if you have a witch and there's no craft, you are not the step. But immediately somebody gets the witch and they add the craft to it, you are finished. If somebody is a witch and they don't have the craft, they can't operate. Okay, so how, how do you, you can if you are a witch, they feed you. When you become a witchcraft, you feed yourself. If you are a witch, they design things for you. When you become a witchcraft, then you design things for yourself. Okay. So when your stepchild is just a witch, because she has come into the marriage, you can be able to walk around with her. But when she becomes a witchcraft, you don't take care. Either you go to prison or you will die. The witches and the witchcraft, there are two things. When somebody is a witchcraft, it means that the person has now gotten the ability 
and the opportunity to be able to design something for themselves. They not choose the portion of meat they want to chew if they go for witch hunting and meat eating. So like you, when I am a witch and we are in the camp, the leader will cut the place she doesn't like and give me. Mm -hmm. But when I become a witchcraft and we go and they bring somebody like you, I will choose. And me, I will choose your tie. And at that time, because I have a craft, your bath and your tie, they will cut for me. But when I don't have a craft and I'm just a witch, what happens here is that at that time, the leader of the camp will chew everything and give me both. And because I don't have a craft, I can't do things for myself. Everybody else has a craft. Though. You don't get it easily. You need to do a lot of assignment to graduate and become a witchcraft. One of the things is that you should be able to devise a means of bringing somebody to you. You should be able to devise a means where you can crash a car to have blood. You should be able to devise a means where somebody will beat their husband and they will take her to court. It's a human against you. And you better anyway. And you share with it. You know what? Too strong. 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 You know what? Too and I'm so jago, I'm so bia wasa, I'm so sam shi bia, I'm so jago, I'm so jago. Put in bra, you bra, send it down the base floor. Put to move wasa my. Obu o kran ko kran, kran o be kran o di pabo be gufe. And be careful, it will not touch you. How come it touches? So it's through your child can be a witch, and she can graduate to become a witchcraft. You understand? And to get a witch, it has to be given to you. It's not working like that. Somebody must transfer to you. Nobody becomes a witch by virtue of being a demon. Somebody must give you that particular when thing. You don't like it. When you don't like it, they don't create a platform for it. Okay. How do, how do you create a platform? Oh, there are some behaviors that can lead you to get witchcraft. Like, Convertiousness can give you opportunity to become a hero. When you are convertious, or you like quarrel, or you, you, you don't understand things, when you are too understanding, they can give you witchcraft. <coughs> when you are too misunderstanding, they can give you witchcraft. And when you are somebody who everything you see you like, they can give you witchcraft. If you are somebody that you are trying to stretch to take what you are not supposed to take, they can give you witchcraft. So, obi to me, woba, no, no, I said, you're not going to be able to do it because you're so for distraction. I know person who will protect you. So, the witches will also want to protect their things. And whatever you have that you use to protect yourself becomes a mini god for you to worship. So Obi made another witch. I told you that it's not because they always become witches, but the process by which the mother wanted to have a child, when they visited, they were asked to do something. If they don't do this, what will come? And then they get a spirit that will manipulate them. So witchcraft is a series of manipulation. Some people can lie. They are pathological liars. They are kleptomaniacs. They steal. I mean, every negative thing that happens, they are part of it. Even when demonstration happens and they are not there, in the realm of the spirit, they can carry their face and go and post it. They like the way people do to me. Things I have not said. Then they go and write with my name because, like you see, Mugabe style, they write this and say, Mugabe said, Mugabe said this. So they can carry your face, familiar spirit, and use it. So all these things are there. But today we're not teaching witchcraft and everything. Yes, but I'm saying that your question is possible a stepchild can be a witch in the family. But every witch you find in your family, seek for those who carry power. Prophet Emmanuel Ejay is one of the men, among other men, who can deal with witchcraft. Don't fight the child, don't beat the child. I know a story of a father who had a stepchild at, at home and the child was so distracted and everything. One day he beat the child up thinking the child would die. In the evening, then he started shaking in bed. He had fever. Only God saved him. Because I have been following him and I have been following him. It's later that he shared with us that he dreamt that he was being beaten. And in the realms of the spirit, when you dream that you are being beaten, be careful. This is what I want to tell somebody. Somebody said you dreamt about me carrying bola. Eh? See, you said, eh? Do you carry bola to go uh -huh. to work? And, and I said, if you dream about me carrying bola, it's a good omen. Mm -hmm. Why do I say it's a good omen, Rodi? Mm -hmm. Dr. Sian, the owner of Zulayo, mm -hmm. where he sleeps, what does he think about? Mm -hmm. Is it not bola? So if Dr. Sian will wake up in the morning and have a dream that the former Sodom and Gomorrah area, where the minister have cleared the people and it's more clear than any other place. All the refuse there, Dr. Sian of Zoom Lion dreams that he is carrying the baller from that area and go and dump it. Is he a bad dream? Um, why is he not dreaming of money? Why is he dreaming of money? What is the money? What is the net worth of Sian's money? Is he not baller? It's not true. Is he Josper? No, Josper group of companies. Do you know 
going to do? Their cash cow is Bola. Right now, he has now graduated by collecting people's Bola and turning it to Manu. So when you dream that I'm carrying Bola, there are too many Bola around me. I want to go and throw them away. So I am carrying Bola and I'll become a rich person after. Because people like you who have money around me, Bola is blocking the money. I'm carrying it away. So, mommy, Diana has soon said, I'm going to throw a Bola in there. I need more baller to carry. So these things can also jump you. And saying about dream, a woman called me one of the said, Hey, oh yes. Yes. She says she keeps dreaming that the stepchild is always sitting on, on her tummy, naked. You see, it's scary. And she has been in the marriage right now for five years. The husband brought this child after five years or one or three years. And finally, but ever since the child came into the marriage, every day she's dreaming the child is sitting on her and she has not been able to put to bed. Yes, on way. So you see, she's now thinking that by the virtue of the dream, the stepchild could be a witch. And the stepchild is blocking her from getting pregnant. But it's a dream. It could be a familiar spirit. It could be real. That truly speaking, as you're saying, the child is being used as a weapon against you. So I told her, let's go to the other side. Like Jesus said, let's travel to the other side. Don't use your physical thing. And your father said, you have the dream. If you don't take care, you will come and manifest the dream physically and you get trouble. Because imagine, Rosie, you are in marriage and pregnancy is not coming. And every time you dream, your stepchild is sitting on your tummy. Can you imagine? When you wake up in the morning, every imagine? good thing you are doing for that child, you will stop. But you see, this is where the issue is. Where a dream is, you are you're wondering which is right or which is not right. Okay. Okay. And now on Sunday, you should go image. Sunday, you see a Palani image. You want to say it. Okay. What you have to say? But Rose, who had a dream? So when you have dreams, they are challenging. Bible says that when Joseph had a dream, when he got up in the morning, he went to the mother and father and shared with the mother and father I had a dream. The sun and the moon were bowing to me because the father has the giftings of interpreting dreams. He said, do you mean me and your mother will bow before you? Clear off! That was Joseph. So at the end of the day, when people have dreams, you need people who can interpret dreams to give you the interpretation. But don't follow the literal interpretation and begin to fight. Because if you have your own dream, the dream if you don't tell anybody is in your heart. But you are beating the stepchild because you think the stepchild is the reason why you are not taking seat. My sister, let's check. And unfortunately for me, when I had a talking with her, the few minutes we spoke, the problem is not her. The husband has a low spermatozoa. And he's refusing to go and get the booster. So why is the demon here? Now the questions are coming up. Is the stepchild truly a child for the man? Yet they are shallow. Hey, you see where the trouble is coming from. But say no spermatozoa. They can happen at any time. So you lose her. Maybe I'm not. A couple of months we need. Without the lamp, without the lamp, the day. No, no. Or find the energy they call high. The glory at the end of the euro, or Jack Gloria, I call you a co high. And the baby suit me, my spell euro. What does it? So we are now going to the deeper of the thing, and the man is cooperating nicely. Formerly, he didn't want to go anywhere because of Baba. But after talking to her, him, he's not agreeing with me, okay? Obeko, wa preso, nayan koshe. So you see, wan bank, yeah, who said the range you alone. So his appearance is what brought. The notice to me that he has a low spam count. Only me get two nana me. Eh, say get out of fight. Only me. Eh, but out of fight. But only me nana me. Yes, only you. The grandchild. Eh, that's a key. Well, no, be out of fight. Then the grandchild. They say, eh, grandfather can't say. Oh, 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 there are circumstances surrounding the stepchildren we are having at home. Some of them, we are looking at them like demons. Somebody took, this week, after our show, somebody called me and said, 
my, the, the lecture I gave has caused her to change her mind. She took the step child. Rose, let me tell you one of the difficult things, even me as a pastor. Mm -hmm. I can't drink oil. Mm -hmm. Olive oil. Have you tried it before? No, um, unless I've cooked with it. If you put olive oil now in my throat, I'll vomit. But, you, but pastors have been telling thank people, drink thank it. You, thank you. Drink it. So, so let me tell you this. Let me pour the anointing oil in your mouth. Thank you. It will heal you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. These things are by faith. They can put it just a drop, yeah. and whatever God wants to do, it will happen. Take the child out, it will happen. The reason is that usually the woman who called me said, BBS, me banner or tin on this who has been changed. So he has a stepchild, and their, their husband is not here. But the child is becoming like a green one. Some people go on fires. So he took the child to the pastor, and they gave the child oil. When the child drank the oil, the child vomited, and now the child is sick and weak. Oh, okay. And I'm saying it's not deliverance. Because even me, when you give me olive oil now, I will vomit. Yeah. I'm not saying there's no power in olive oil drinking. Yeah. But the fact that the boy vomited doesn't mean the boy is a witch. Yeah. Once they gave the child the oil, you know, see, no, see, oh, no. Yeah, the children is such a class of any man of fear. So I also want to tell you people that fighting your stepchild will not help your marriage. Manage them. If my stepchild has been diagnosed as a witch, I'll be very happy. Do you know why? Because dealing with witches are one of my giftings. Rosie, if you are a witch watching me right now, and you come to me, John Dimitro, and I give you my phone to dial a number, you, if you are truly possessed, immediately you manifest and you can move. The assets around me. That's you, but imagine those. So, 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 uh, so I'm telling you that yeah. I can do that for you. Yeah. Do you know if I transfer? So I tell you, Rosie, the boy at home, all you need to do is to buy me a bottle of water. Uh -huh. Bring it to me. I evoke that into the bottle of water. Let it be part of the drinking water at home. The water will not be for only the stepchild. Everybody is drinking the same water. But because I have mandated the water to look for whatever is in the place, whoever is carrying the negative omen, when they take the water, they will manifest. So I don't single out people. When there's a trouble in your house and I do the things for you, I do for the whole house. Right. So that the other day, the, the one that is not carrying the right spirit will be exposed. So I'm pleading with you, those of you who are having challenges with your stepchildren, the way you are circling them and keeping them out, and your pastor knows I call any number or your bon sampa, I cry entity with them. My sister, stop cooking for the child alone. Mm -hmm. Rosalie, let the child eat from the same bowl everybody is eating. But at the end of the day, the food I am cooking is carrying the mandate that when you eat the food that you are keeping the wrong spirit from your mother, that thing will expose you and your mother. So managing the stepchild, you need a lot. I went to where I go to because you asked whether they become witches. And I'm saying this because a lot of the people that call me, they have been some going on make And I'm bad one here. I'm being you four. Almost sour they are sick. Let me tell you the last one that somebody called me. The woman said, when I finished, when I called, I was even on, on your premises here. She called and said, unfortunately for her, ni kuru ni mkwalano, ni kuru kwa for G. See her own. She has only one child with this man. But the man has gone to have a lot of children and she has a heart, like I said, to go and collect. But look at what she said. He says, ever since she went to collect a child and brought the children to the house, nothing is working in the house again. So I asked, why is nothing working in the house? Yeah. Only a four. Dad no more dog in the Now come.
Very important, last week, Rosalie was out here. I tackled her last question before she left. But let me do the answer for you now. Is it compulsory? The word compulsory is what I want to deal with. Or necessary. The word necessary or compulsory, they're not the same word. When you say something is necessary, it means that it's a necessity by choice. Compulsory is by compulsion. It's like a legal thing. So as we sit, Rosalie and Nico, but ultimately that, and you compose, we say, you're showing us all that. So the word compose, we. I don't I don't know I don't know I don't know how to so the word compulsory is, is, is a strong legal hey. thing. But Rosalie, <laughs> once I want to marry you and you have a child, knowing the child has connection with the father is important. Yeah. Simple. But it is, it is necessary, but not compulsory. Necessary, but not compulsory. But not compulsory. So, so thing, Eric, the other thing is that the content of that information is very, very, very necessary. What do you tell? What do you tell me? Are you coming to give me the rundown of what happened to the pregnancy? No. All I need from you is that you are telling me specifically that this child has a father. And the father of the child is George Dimitro. Case close. Case close. Mike no Case close. To Mike Nuhu. Case closed. So it is necessary, Eric. And thank you very much for asking this very, very deep question. It is necessary, but not compulsory. It is necessary, but not compulsory. Necessary, but not compulsory. So let's do it. It's very, very important. It's necessary and not compulsory. But you should know the woman you're living with, the father of the child. But that, that leads me to our conversation today before we wrap up. That what should be the connection between the stepchild's father, and then, put it on me, stepchild's father and the child there, or the stepmother's connection with the other one here. The reason is because, say, one shed the year, no one can the year, no one give the year, one for shot, bear the year. There are some of us who are offended when our wives are still in communication with, more my so, in communication with. Communication with, don't forget, communication with the children's father. The question is that the children's father, the children's mother, they are very important in the life of the children. So anytime your wife is still talking to the children's father, what should be your problem? So it is necessary. It might not be compulsory. It is necessary that you know that I am, I am marrying Rosalind Feli. And he has a child with George Luthor. But, like I said last week, don't make George Luthor your friend. Don't be the one intermediary between uh, Rosalind Feli and the ex-husband. Don't be a mogul. Well, she calls it a mogul. So what I'm saying is that it is necessary, but not compulsory. If I've answered Eric, that's okay. The network is bad for them, but they will come to you. Let's it's raining. Them. Oh, sorry. As for Ghana, we have our own giftings and challenges. When it rains, we have network challenges. Now we'll go through. So, Rosie, managing your stepchild, the inconveniences are many. But like I said last week, when you're not here, if you have a stepchild with a man, the first thing we are discussing is about managing a stepchild as a woman and a wife. Don't forget that statement. We are managing as a woman and a wife. So we've not come to the men. Because the challenges for the men whose wife bring children are limited. But the problems and the hurt feelings are the women. The women. And your man. They don't know how to manage. And the reason why they have more challenges is because they manage the home. Rose in the chefy. Say Rose in the Baba Wadiasi. I call him bread. And say about Frau Mamma Wadiasi and Umbre. 
Abofra o papa. Any hour they said, who now will be there? Hey, hey, hey. Because the reason is because you are the manager of the home. You are the manager of my home. All I do is to give you money and you cook for the house. So it's difficult for your child whose father is not here to not to get, yes. But it's easy for my child whose mother is not here to say, I don't like. Look, growing up, eh, I always use myself for example. Whatever my mother provides mm -hmm. is what I eat. Rosie, the current children we have in my house, they have choices. Yeah, but that's the ones that evolved. So what do you expect? They have choices. The ones that evolved. But in my house, it wasn't like that. I don't meet their choices every time. Mm -hmm. Once in a while, I can do that. Yeah. So imagine with my stepchildren in the house, my wife is not doing the same thing for them. There'll be confusion. We can't be, we are all eating rice and contaminants too. And one of my boys will say that, that if I don't like rice and contaminants food, I like jollof rice. Who should cook jollof rice for you? Are we eating poison? Is the rice and contaminants too poison? Are you allergic to contaminants? Yeah. You're putting stress on your mother. Like if you don't feel like eating, Eat and die. No, don't do that. I've done that. The children of this generation, they are different from. Rosie, do you know why my wife can easily manage me? Yeah. And why more women can manage me? Because Anybody who is close to me, I don't determine what I want to eat. I eat what is available. Rosie, I've never gone out to buy food. If I buy food from any restaurant and you ask me, is it nice? You've asked me a foolish question. Because you don't know. The only food I check about taste is my mother's food. That's all. All good. good. Ah. The only time I realized that there's a change in my house food was the time my mother-in-law came to visit us when my wife delivered. And I saw the difference between my mother-in-law's food and my wife's food. Then I saw the difference. That's what I want to get to visit my cultural uh, ministry. Uh, 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 okros too. My, my mother-in-law's okros too. You will feel the okros too. It's the shop of Now I'm going to be for I saw the difference. But I didn't keep that taste. If I could have kept that taste, my wife would have suffered. So I don't have taste. I eat to grow. Yes. But in the house, my, even this morning, my son, when they gave my son uh, uh, Milo to drink, because he's used to carbell coconut, he called me and said, the tea is like, it's bitter. It's not nice. <laughs> this morning, imagine he's one of my stepchildren. And telling the mother this. And when he said that, I was like, I said, why? I said, daddy, today the tea is like there's coffee inside. I feel like it's all coffee that. How do you do this coffee? <laughs> this morning. So I went to the mother and said, did you add coffee to it? I said, coffee. There's no coffee in this house. Said, I said, ah, our Labani gentleman is saying that there's coffee. He said, no, no, no. This is the reason. Look at the mother. The reason is that every day I feed them with cowbell coconut. But today I decided to give him milk. So I went and I tasted the tea. There's nothing wrong with it. But child psychology, I carried milk and added it. Once I added the milk, you say, yes, that is mine now. <laughs> <laughs> this morning experience. Imagine this is a stepchild. Yeah. If there is no relationship, but that's what I want to say. Last week I told you, don't treat all the children the same. And you need to understand. They asked me, should we treat all of them the same? I said, no. Rose, the woman tears here. Let the stepchild know that he or she is a stepchild. However, give all of them equal page and stage. That's the now you Give all the children equal page and stage. Based on their age, let their stage perform what they are doing. Based on the, let them have the same thing. So, yet, yet, you do a fear. They don't have the same medium of communication. My mother will feel my stepchildren, they all know that nobody comes to daddy direct. Everybody talks to mommy. And from mommy, mommy, that's the protocol. So, because your mother is in a marriage, who part there? Because who papa and you no, no, you don't want to talk to your daddy about anything. You talk to mommy, mommy talks to me. When they come back from school, anything, it's not because uh, you are special. And my mother, if your mother, that's why my children, none of them have connection to their mother to talk to them. No. My stepchild. Yeah, her mother will talk to her on which phone? Which phone? Really? No, who's which phone? Your phone. My phone. Ah, so if my, my stepdaughter, if, if my 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 uh, 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 our my 
my child has brought into the marriage. Their mother wants to talk to her. Who will she talk to? Me. She talks to me. And I will tell the mother, my, my wife at home, if it's nothing for my wife to do. Right. But I'm not giving my daughter a phone mm -hmm. so that my, my ex-wife will call my daughter. Right. So that my ex-wife will give message to my daughter to come and tell me. Or I'll be there. Then my ex-wife will call me and say, eh, our, our daughter called me this morning and what she was saying, I think that I hate that English. Is it English or? Is it English or girl? Why, why is he not talking to her? Ah, that? That my ex-wife will call me. That eh, I don't want to interfere in your home. But the fact that I am not your wife in that house, I have a child with you. This is how they start. It. And once I have a child with you, the matters in your home matters me because my child is there. And I'm quite listening to them. Then the next statement is that I want you to put your food at the corner. Otherwise, whilst you think you are you are sleeping, your legs are outside. Mm -hmm. And I said, Me neighbor, what's the problem? My daughter called me and said, Your wife A B C D in the house. And it's a C. She has become a rival to our daughter in the house. Stop it. She means up or down. I will deal with you and you will never ever dream of that statement. You tell me this. Put my foot down in my own house. I don't want to tell you to put my foot down. You don't see my foot hanging? Is my foot hanging? If my foot is hanging, will your daughter be in this house? Your daughter had the guts to tell you what my wife is doing. And you are telling me to put my foot down. What is she doing? My wife chooses that in the morning. Instead of us eating 7 o'clock, 7 a.m., nobody will eat 7 a.m. again on Saturday. Every Saturday, our breakfast is taken after 11. If your daughter has ulcer, so she has to eat early, what are we supposed to do? We are supposed to understand that for her, she has ulcer. So we we'll let her eat early. But she won't sleep in the bed. What do you mean? Then your mother will come and call you and then, me if you are busy. When you are sick, what do you do? You tell my wife. She's not your mother. But you tell her. Then you call your mother and tell her that. And when you are sick, they don't give you a medicine. Nonsense. So you can't come. You see, you can't cross and use my daughter in a house to come and deal with me. For that matter, I don't even give my daughter a phone at all. And my girl, if your mother gives a message, she swallows it and go and poo poo in the toilet. <laughs> because whatever the mother told her, she can't tell me because I am not her communication partner. Partner. It is my wife. So one of the things you have to learn, managing them, mm -hmm. give them the same stage, on the same page. Mm -hmm. They all go to the same school. Let all of them go to Ghana International. Mm -hmm. Let all of them go to the same school. Don't change their, their food they eat unless they are allergies. Yes. No, when they are allergies. Don't let your children eat in plastic plates and let my child eat in broken plates. One time I chance on... on, on my, uh, 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 one of the girls eating in the plate, which is my plate. And I asked her, why are you eating my plate? She says, oh, because the food was left inside. Mommy says, did mommy tell you to eat in my plate? She says, it, it's not true. You've broken the rule. Pour it in another plate. You don't eat in daddy's plate. She ends that day. If your mother, the stepmother could have come out to meet her eating in the husband's plate. If my wife confronts the girl, is she wrong? No. You see, I did. But it will become a bad thing. My father finished eating, and I was eating the leftover, and then my stepmother came, and she was just shouting at me, that why should I eat in my father's plate? No. The protocol is that nobody eats my leftover in my plate. Even if my, you are my daughter, my biological child, Rosie, it is a standard in the house that that is plate. Okay. The same way, when you want to wash my plate at home, the standard is that we have a sponge for that plate. My cup, we have a sponge for my cup. And it is a standard that everybody is following. Not because we are a stepchild, not because we are a biological child. So women, hear me, as a wife and a woman, manage what is going on in your home. Give them the same stage. Give them the same page. Let the rules in the house not be stepchildren's rule. Biological children's room. No. No. Wife. No. Right. 
And somebody said last week that the, the wife warned her, warned him that the way he's playing with the daughter. The woman came to the man. You see, what did you say? I buy her so. And then at 20, 25, you have a child. Or at 22, the woman had a child. So, oh, what? I'm going to be two years. He said, son, I get it. She get it. It's always the way you keep saying. Ah, get that. Oh, did you get three or what? The first one is 15. The first one is 15. Yeah, Get it. No, it's 15 years. Get it. Yes, she said, I'll be get it. Who are you getting? Not get it. Get it first. Get it. Get it. Get it first, boy. Hey, me worry get here. The first one may fewer. So when you fifty, let's say I get it. Head thirty five. Let's say the first one you twenty. I go away the twenty. So now we are here. Come on, good man. We are going twenty. So now, my minister, sorry. Then the wife had the guts to tell the husband the way you handle my first daughter. I don't mm -hmm. like. Yes, I know you are being a father to her, but I don't like. The way you have don't chat with my daughter like that, please. Uh, I, I'm a victim. I was 15 when I had her, and for that matter, I I cherish. Sorry, I'm sorry. Sorry, oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Charlie, six. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Seventeen. Let, let me apologize for this break. I mean, uh, unfortunately, the power went off and the internet went. I don't know how to do a backup for the internet. But, uh, so we are back. So those communications, uh, so like I'm saying, a very simple thing. Let me do a wrap up. I mean, I'm sorry, but thank you. I love my loyal listeners and loyal viewers. Unfortunately for us, what really transpired was that he told the man that don't have that connection with my daughter anymore. I think you are getting too close to my daughter. You are making my daughter uh, fall in love with you. And I am scared because I gave up to this girl when I was 15 years. And my girl carries my features. She has my ass. She has my breast. So at 15 years, I carried these things. And that is how I became a victim of pregnancy and gave them to her. So when I see my daughter getting closer to you, it takes me back into that time when I was the flappy girl, everybody loving girl, and I became pregnant and gave her to her. So my husband, I don't like the way you are becoming nice to my daughter. I want you to be a father to my daughter, but don't get close like that the way you're doing. Now the conversation hurts the man. Even though he responded yes, the man was hurt. And that was what I was going to ask Rosalie. Was the woman right or the woman was wrong? Because she's telling us the truth. The truth is that at age 15, she got pregnant by a man. Because she had the features that the, the daughter right now at age 20 is having. My question is, is the woman right or wrong? Once beating, twice shy. For me, where I sit, I don't know Rosalind's thoughts. But if you're married to me, and you think that me, your husband, I can re make me re at the other point. I can have sex with my stepdaughter. There's nothing wrong with it, though. If your husband has the opportunity to sleep with your stepdaughter. Spiritually, there's nothing wrong. Legally, there's nothing wrong. As a matter of fact, your husband can marry your stepdaughter. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. You are confused. If your husband has sex with your daughter, it is not incest. There's nothing wrong with it. There's nothing. No, there's nothing, actually. Because there's nothing blood-related. The mother's blood is not in the daughter. It's only the father's blood. And those who collect the bride price of your daughter are your daughter's father's side. So your husband actually can go and marry your daughter. We are, we are confusing ourselves with a lot of things. So you can go and marry your daughter. 
I am not justifying husbands sleeping with their stepdaughters. No. And I am also not justifying the fact that uh, uh, stepdaughters have, have collected their, 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 their mother's husband. Very Rosalie by then was, was not grown yet. But it happened in Ghana. Was it 85 or 84? A young lady actually took the mother's, the mother's husband, a stepdaughter, or Jenny Mami Kruman Mami Fili. What did I say? Or Jenny Mami Kruman Mami Fili. Jamie Kenny Nani said, once Rosalie cannot come back, let me share my views on that one. For where I sit, I believe that the woman was right. Yes. The woman was right. Why am I saying the woman was right? She has a fear that she has not dealt with. She has a fear that she was 15 years like Getty and got pregnant and had the first child. So if I'm 15 years and you're married to me now and our daughter, my daughter is 20 years, I am scared that when I was 15, I had a big buttocks the big breast, and somebody has sex with me, and I had her. Today, I'm afraid you too. This one is 20. Even 15, they are chopping. How much more 20? Rosie, I wanted your take on this before I wrap up. That the woman told the husband, I don't like the way you are treating, you are, the way you are, you are living with my daughter. Mm -hmm. Even though she's 20. When I was 15, yeah. I had all that she has, the yeah. features. My back, my breast, and somebody impregnated me and gave birth to her. Mm -hmm. I am telling you that I don't like, I know you want to be a father to her, but I am scared because I went through that phase. And I'm asking you, is it right or wrong? Your voice. I don't think it's right for her to say that to her, but anyways, I don't know, I'm trusting it to the woman. Uh -huh. So you see where Rosalind is coming from? She doesn't trust the husband. That is why he's giving the husband word instead. So now they may it here, nobody wait. I don't know, sir. So, uh, be on trusting the crew, or you say the crew is not reaching it. Or money crew no word. She no one wait. If you say, oh, we are a better than your house. You be saying, how come? Aye. It's married. Okay. So the woman is right. Is that what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. She's right. No, I'm saying that she shouldn't tell her husband that. It's not wrong. But, it, but that's when she was 15. Somebody did that. Then well, she needs a psychologist. She needs to go through counseling. So it means that she's not treated before she came to marry. Yes. So she has to go back yes. and be treated. Okay. Yes. So she, she's wrong in telling the husband. Yes. But that's a worry. And so because of what she's been through, she also called her husband. So the husband said you must take and has not taken an advice. The man told me what she wants to tell the woman that I'm begging him is that she wants the woman to let the child go back to the party. That's what the man said. Yes. I'll take answer. I do have a son of me too and I want to say. Me person me you didn't ban over for you. I said, I'm not going to say that. 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 So, is the man also right to think this way? So, the man is right. Yes. Who was you too far? The girl has nowhere to go. No, but the girl has a case. Baby. Ah, well. Say, ah, well, I know they are coming. No, but, but Rosie, she has, she has a case at 15. No, look at your body. At 15. Look at the body you are carrying. No, look at the body you are carrying. Your daughter at 20 is carrying this body. Trust the body about the body and the trust. Leave trust. And then Joseph, or Johnny Yellow. Oh, wait to be good away. Hey, now you're in a good away. Who can't you say? I don't want to come. Say, oh, I caution. So, only 15 years, you know. 
The man is twenty. Why are we able? And a bear man, na obi soya no pa. Ah, that case here ba ogana na wa. The guy, the guy, the lady was so angry to sack the brother-in-law from the house. In the morning, brother-in-law is here boxer shorts. Like me, me a bear man by the field. Now so be sure boxer shorts no pa no dey na mo. And I'm here to do two years. Every man in Koba will do two by. Then he has seven now. Me, 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 I can't do any quarter so. Seven the quarter. Now, or so I'm not paying no good quarter. Me, me, I can't do any kura. I want boxer shorts. Me, me, I'm not down with them. Any kuma ya. And the old man in Koba. Now, so no share boxer shorts. Then I'm free or no. So then I'm going to say, ah, nah. I'm like it's a boxer shorts. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm not catching it. Oh, me, I'm not. Oh, me, you're here. I'm not paying no kura. All she found. Nibiani so fun fi fi onko. Mo so si enye fe. O ba no mu kwoti na wan hwa no su da ti wa ko se. Na se o e ya re hu o se. Rosie, se o ti kwoti wan kiti kiti se. Me mi nya kuma. Ya mi nya kuma o yi ya. E ti ku kunu ni biya. Se de no nim se o ka se be ma ne busu ko sa de ti e ma ni nya kiti o de ba ni. Hwe ko ti o kura. Akwala o ni ye, hwe ko ti o kura. Na ni kuna wa nyiru. E e busu fo fo be ye su. What you are if you are and do me, Tibia. What you are so you did you My issue is that the lady has a genuine case, but I don't think that the way she presented the case to the husband is right. Because I remember somebody to what she did was to advise the daughter. When we are alone in the house and your father is here alone. Go to classes. Go to the lobby to learn. Because the woman thought of plano age, you know, to fear of a year. So the issue is about this stepchild. This is a stepchild issue, and the man wants the child to go back. Fakulano kono baba o na marino. This decision, it's a wrong decision. The wife has a problem, and the best thing the man can do is to sit the wife there and say, honey. I won't do that to your daughter or our daughter or your daughter in the best way. Don't say our daughter. I won't do that to your daughter. I think that that experience you have is still in you. The man who did that to you is no more. He did that to you and left. We need counsel. No, but that's the best way you should talk to your wife. Communication. Hey, nobody. 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 Hey, quick, quick, man, I'm going. Ah, you're breaking the rule. Which rule? You. Now we are going to now. Now only we get two wrongs. Yes. Yes. The man should rather help the wife to go through counselling to believe that no, only the pastor said to believe that the year 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 woman will be your baby. Ah, come on, counsellor. There be so any or 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 counsellor you go with counsellor. Counsellor is support zero two seven seven six zero nine six support. My name is Fred. So, I mean, these are some of the issues we have with our stepchildren. And as I end today, if you learn to manage your stepchild, if you learn to know how to talk to your stepchild, especially when it, when it comes to interactions with your husband, the, the house will be more peaceful. Give them the same stage, the same age. Don't treat your daughter special and treat your stepchild too in a different way. My sister, I understand you are hurting. But don't use your anger to beat this child. Otherwise, you go to a salon. Otherwise, you lose your marriage. Don't be angry and speak like the way this woman spoke to the husband. That I'm afraid you will chop our daughter. If your husband will chop your daughter, it is not by virtue of your word. Some of our stepdaughters, they are very edible. Do you know why? Because when I married you, you were young like your stepdaughter. Right now, I see your daughter coming up like the time I married you. So some of you, the women too, who brought children to the marriage, respect us the men. Every day you wake up, congratulate us for not chewing your daughter. Congratulate us. <laughs> Stepchildren are blessings, but they become blessings when you manage them well. Keep your husband's children in the house. 
Even your own child, bring them to come and join the, the same house. And by so doing, you become a young man. If you want a platform to go and advertise your thing, it's not my platform. See what you have come to post on my platform. <laughs> Omega Tours. Omega Travel is organizing a five You're also reading for him. <laughs> Omega Tours. Who is better? You, you are in Ghana. I've been to the US before. Omega Tours, you, have you traveled before? You are here collecting visa for people. If you are qualified, why are you in Ghana? Because the about to find out. When they're on, I'm out. I leave. What's the economy for Omega Travel? Anything come up? I'm not here. Oh, here, me. I'm not here. 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 i Say, I'm passing who said me, Namas Nedor, so now Pesso Betron de Oha. For poor my respect, not frame it. Namin joke, a crown of bear advert. Namia, where about Copa? Namia, the umbra, a sample, but as the seven bedroom. Mamma and Cassa mean you see Canami advertise here. Now, the other two, if you want to travel to Canada, Abruci, who are what you want to Canada? Who will be a pie at the monk of one can come? Who are what number way? Who will suit the gun and crew my ashes? Munja metetem. Obi a who had that thing? Obi a kwano ya konfo. Oju si ka onfa onko. Omega travel ento. Eya criminal travel ento. Oma jin kofo si ke biya wa si si ani omo kokot. Enti mi page so one me delete no. But now can we pen da da da. Ah ah na so chia muse. Number no zero five five one zero eight six two eight zero. Omo ya konfo. What do passwords mo mo me tuwa shemu do bifo frako. I'm on your travel and talk. I'm your criminal What's agency. What you say? 0277 609 644. 0277 609 644. Hey, yeah. That's your bending day. Boss, you are a big man. And when they see a small boy not working, they call you big man. Don't relax. Get up and go and see what they are calling you for. It's a teamwork. Don't sit there and do that. It's a wrong attitude. Get up. You're sitting there. It's nothing. If you can do it, they won't call you. When they respect you, follow their respect. I grow up up anyway. Hmm. What you can do in two seconds, the boy is taking 30 minutes to do. Utinu se nkurebi. Ujimi se silly brush. Enya mo na me ya kwebi ujimi wan ma ya na ma wai. Zero two seven seven six zero nine six. So let me say a big thank you to Body Line Clothing my outfit and a big thank you to Mr. Young for my shoes and for the rest of you who are seeing the ginger chips as usual let me tell you the new baby on the block is not in this form but this form is sold for the executive it's a premium package it's called premium package so when you are buying this one at 10 cities we won't sell this at 10 cities too as well I am trying to get a price for it so that we'll sell it and this one will still go for 10 cities we're a rubber we're a nice package the same quantity, the same taste, but different packaging. Thank you very much. God bless you. I'll see you. Thank you for your misunderstanding. I'll be your counselor for now. The man feels the lady is hiding a lot from him. A man happened to marry a lady in the same church who already has a son. The request to know the father of the boy before the marriage, but the lady at, oh, no, no, no. Uh, you need counseling for that particular statement. Don't. They went ahead to marry her and later to know that their child is for the pastor of the church or what. They went ahead to marry later to know that the father was, the, was also in the church. Yes. You don't need to have a friend with the church, but you need to know the father of the child. And it is not compulsory, like I said. It is <coughs> a choice. 0277-609-624. Let the child call me. And once you call me, I'll be able to solve the issue. Bye-bye for now. Sorry today, our transmission was very bad because there was a light off and our internet went off. We have to apologize. Because when you don't apologize, you have disrespected the people who are there. Let me let you know that if you want to talk to me, 0277 Also, don't forget that the same number is mobile money. Those of you who love me, send me mobile money. Let me go and buy something to eat. And I will suck my teeth on your behalf. May you miss him. Thank you very much, Mary. The package is down here. 
As for you, this girl, one day you understand. Bye bye for now. Till I see you again.